It was literally a week ago that Microsoft reaffirmed that TPM 2.0 is a hard requirement for Windows 11, despite the fact we all know it's incredibly easy to bypass. However, now for some reason they are literally backpedaling on it, saying that this feature will no longer be a requirement if people want to upgrade to the latest version of Windows. Why? Well, they probably just woke up, looked at the calendar and saw that the end of support date for Windows 10 is now less than a year away, and most of the user base still hasn't found the update Windows button, or the hardware isn't even able to support it. So some concessions had to be made so they don't find themselves in a rather awkward situation there. Now, you will be able to install Windows 11 even without TPM 2.0, which is a pretty great thing. Though, they still said that there could be some issues caused by that, and they are threatening you with hardware instability, lack of updates to Windows 11, and much more if you still don't have a TPM 2.0 module. Which granted, many modern PCs do, but still, so many older systems, not even that old, won't be able to run Windows 11 without this concession right here. Again, unless you just type in a single command. Microsoft are hoping that this step will probably encourage more people to upgrade, have at the same time with so much fear-mongering about what it's like, if you don't have TPM, it still may cause a lot of people to rethink if they want to update in the first place, kind of making this entire thing backfire. So why do you think they're doing this? Is Microsoft in cahoots with PC manufacturers trying to drive sales of more modern PCs? Or are they just trying desperately to finally convince people to upgrade to Windows 11 before they take Windows 10 behind the shed next year? Well, you let me know down in the comments below of what do you think of all of this, and maybe check out a Patreon as well, because this December, all Ultra tier patrons will be getting a special Christmas card from me. Plus, huge thanks to Gavin Burns, Justin Rage, Ella Vronyak, Bellish Voka, Patrick Harrison, not a pseudonym, Mick Sumner, Shane Allcroft, and Level Up. But anyway, that's all it's. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Good. Bye.